Good morning, and welcome to our cabin, which and is in Tortola. Yes, we have <laughs> never been here before. No, so we're excited to explore. We're doing well. We're doing limited exploration. Right. We're going to try to have a beach day today in Tortola. Because you know Newport, new beaches to explore. That's true. But first, breakfast. Mm -hmm. So I think we're going to go to Garden Cafe, which mm -hmm. is the buffet. Yeah. Um, it looked good. That's what we saw yesterday, right? A million so. different stations with similar options, but that's convenient. One million. They had banana well, like caramel waffle. Nine. So, yeah. yeah. So, breakfast, mm -hmm. and then I think we're heading out. So, Yay. woo. Oh, <laughs> uh, wow. They've got a towel station right out here in our elevator lobby, so we don't have to go all the way up to the pool deck, yeah. even though we're going up to the pool deck oh. to eat. <laughs> Welcome back to Garden Cafe. Step one. Washy washy. So the buffet is self-serve style, not crew assisted style. We've got bacon, potatoes, eggs, some kind of a cool looking brown bread. That looked like, I don't know, some kind of an apple topped cinnamon bun or something. And some oatmeal with raisins and maybe turbinado sugar or a brown sugar. And your silverware is already on the table other than the spoons which I grabbed up by the oatmeal. He has gotten an omelet made to order. French toast, bacon, oatmeal as well. Oh, uh, Ricky hit that waffle station I see with the banana caramel waffles. Laura done with biscuits and gravy. Okay. And they did come take breakfast orders. They have brought us a whole lineup of coffee and some iced orange juice. Stir shot time. Mm, that was okay. Ooh, there is some glary tortola. We'll get some better tortola here in a bit. So welcome officially to Tortola. Woo! Oh, there's a towel exchange station right here by the ship too. That's handy. Oh, there's a giant whale shark. We didn't really get to see this side of the ship. Woo! Looks like we're gonna head through this big gate. Over here, I see signs for taxis. Fruit popsicles. All right, don't get distracted. Don't get distracted. <laughs> Got Diamonds International. That'll be a new one for us. Croc store. So here's your shopping lane. Got some rental car booths over there. We're still walking toward the taxis. And got some steel drum music. Success! Right, we came up and said we want to go to Cane Garden Bay. It's $8 per way per person. So 16 round trip for Cane Garden Bay. This is the drop-off point and the point where we will be picked up later on. A little visitor information center, but let's come check out this beach. Ooh, look at this. So two chairs, umbrella free Wi-Fi. For $20. And a cocktail. Oh. That's a deal. $20. Fantastic. Whoosh. Look at all that. So we're at Glen Seaside Beach Bar and Restaurant. Let's just bask for a minute. We're getting ready to go bask from the water, of course, but oh yeah. Sandy, watery, just what I like in a beach. Woo, it's beautiful out here. Now we are all ready for water mode. So we're told it's a pretty shallow entry. Nice and sandy. Oh gosh, all I see is sand. Well, this is downright pleasant. <laughs> yeah. Shallow and sandy, and I'm still walking. Oh, it just got just got to the goodies, so we're gonna keep going. I haven't seen a rock yet. Not good for snorkeling, but it's good for swimming. I think Brewers Bay was the snorkeling hot spot. All the time. This is lovely. This is lovely. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. I don't even care that I can't see any fish. I know. It's a little. <laughs> once you get out here, it's a little stirred up. So I don't know that the no. snorkeling would but be I, good. I knew that. And this. Okay, just look at the scenery, though. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. Oof! I'm all the way down. It's deep. Let's just look at all the scenery. 
all these umbrellas, all these people. Why y'all in my shot? Y'all in my scenery <laughs> shot? <laughs> Who are these people? We just randomly shot Boom. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> and I'm my first ever Tortola spin. With me. Uh, you get to be in the spin. Oh, I'm getting over my head, the spin. Oh, music? music? I don't know what's happening. Uh oh, spin interrupted because I'm over my head and I can't turn. <laughs> Gosh, help. Well, oh, it does get deep. It's weird. We had a tiny part of a spin. That's all we get. <laughs> like one minute I was standing on the ground, now I'm not. Spin, spin interrupted. Mm. <laughs> well, Dee is off to swim. She's not going to see any fish, but maybe she'll go touch a buoy or something. Of course, she doesn't have a camera, so we'll have no proof. <laughs> Bye. Don't swim to Joss Van Dyke or Virgin Gorda. <laughs> or St. Thomas, because we can see St. Thomas from here. We were thinking to do the baths today, because we have a nice long day, and everybody's like, go to Tortola, you gotta do the baths. But, you know, we figured our first time to Tortola, we'll stay on Tortola, because you have to go to another island to get to the baths. And plus, we've heard that if you do the baths, like, a, from the ocean side, it's a lot better than the baths from the land side. And the ship didn't seem to have any, um, ocean side excursions. The Encore did that we were supposed to be on, but I couldn't find any on the Escape. So, eventually, we'll get back here, I'm sure, and do the baths from the ocean side. The land side is a very rocky approach, and I've heard it can be tight for, like, tall, big people. So, you know. You know. What's your update? What did you see out there? I swam to the buoy. Oh, nice. <laughs> Nothing, but the water is so smooth. I don't know what it is. It's lovely. It's, I said lovely again, it's, didn't I? It's very lovely. <gasps> the lovely <laughs> day. <laughs> yeah, you All went over there in the back. You went far. It was awesome. <laughs> All right, our earlier spin got interrupted. Let's see if we can spin. We got D in the spin. Ricky, Laura, Deb, Brian. Look at all this fancy spin action. All this beach. We are kind of amazed at how like <laughs> tall the waves are here. Like one second we'll yeah. be pretty much standing, standing outside the water, and then next thing you know, your feet come off the ground. Like right now. Yeah. There you go. You just lost. <laughs> but it's like it's not like the sand. Oh, the sand must be shifting because it's been, it's not scary waves. It's just kind of fun. Actually. Yeah. No, it's really nice. I like it. But here, I think maybe the tide's coming in. Yeah. You just kind of you're standing, That's and then weird. all of a sudden we get picked up and floated away. It's very nice here. I've heard all the beaches are really, really pretty in Tortola, then, but this is obviously our first time here. Hello! <laughs> I'm like <laughs> towards the camera. <laughs> Stop it! Help me! Fun float day. So we arranged, I think, I don't even know if we talked about it, we arranged with our driver to come get us at a certain time. I think. Right. We told him, yeah, we wanted to be picked up at 3.30, so he's going to come pick us all up at 3.30. Um, but that was pretty handy, so not too far of a walk from the ship to get to the taxi stand. No, it was about a 15 minute ride, and currently it was $8 per person, but I have no idea how much it normally, you know, would be. Yeah, and he, have to negotiate or whatever. he had a whole card with like yeah. six beaches he could take yeah. you to but we had gotten the intel from Brian and Deb <laughs> that Cane Garden Bay was the place to come. I see why. It's beautiful. Yeah, look at this big sunshine ball on the top of my hand. It's amazing. We're floating for now. So that's it. Bye. Update to the update. We went up there. Actually, Ricky and Laura went up there to try to redeem what we thought we heard was a welcome drink that came with our chair package. Apparently the lady said no. So the thing about the welcome drink was not correct, I guess, but it was two chairs, an umbrella, and wi free Wi-Fi for $20 total. Yeah, so there we go. No welcome drink. Well, it's about quarter after one. We have been here for a few hours. It's getting a little more popular over here, but not crazy popular. We've just been swimming it's and so floating. Nice. That's all we're doing. So every now and then we turn the camera on and say, hey guys, we're swimming and floating. Yeah. Ooh, it's a perfect temperature though. <laughs> We are going to take a field trip now. Oh gosh, if the waves don't drag us back out to sea. We're, we're on a, a very struggle bus field trip <laughs> to get maybe some drinks and some stuff like that. So, cool. So, Glen Seaside Beach Bar and Restaurant. There's our drink menu. Most of your drinks are seven. We got buckets of beer. Oh yeah, I think this is the same menu we saw before, but a little easier to read on this big colorful sign. Rum Punch Cam. We're getting ready to hit the water again. And now we return to the sea. Already in progress. You gotta time your entry so that you don't get knocked down. 
We've reapplied. I probably have sunscreen all over my face, but that's fine. And now we're back in ocean mode 2.0. That's it. That's the update. Ocean mode is still happening. It's 2 o'clock. Okay. That's not bad. Not too bad. So about an hour and a half. The day goes fast when you're just floating. It really does. Whoa. <laughs> We are getting ready to call an end to water mode. Time to go. <sighs> we got a few afternoon basking views of our beach before we get out of here. Ooh, look at all this gloriousness. Deb to find a puppy. Gosh, D has located a dog. Oh, Deb brought treats for the dogs. Puppy. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yep, we found a new home. <laughs> we adopted a dog. Nice. Very sweet. You like that donut. You've got a collar, so I'm hoping you have a good home around here somewhere. It looks well taken care of. Yeah. Animals. I don't know. I don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah, he's just chilling on me, buddy. Very pretty. It is almost time. We sold the cab driver 3.30 and the hour is approaching. We're drip drying and enjoying some last few moments here. Ah. Oh, they got some rental rates and stuff like that up there. Nice. All right, let's go get our cab. There's like a free shuttle loop yeah. you can take here and everything. Anyway, we are back. Back to the ship. Well, Dee and Laura are due a stop in the Diamond Center National because this is a brand new DI for us. I know. That's cute. Cute. What is that? A fan tail with a shovel. Oh, I like it. So now we're going to head back into this little pink building, which will put us straight at the ship. Yeah, <sighs> Yes, I saw a turtle. <laughs> Look at that Tortola and my shadow recording Tortola. Mm. Oh yeah, there's that sneaky little water slide that sticks over the side of the ship with the little clearing part. Cool. And we might as well go ahead and swap our wet towels out for dry right here before we get on the ship. Yes. They've got iced water, flavored water, towels, I guess, for your face as you come back on. Right, so fresh and so clean. Oh, look at this little lounge. They could set up a grill out here and do some food. <laughs> All aboard. Hey, we are all cleaned up for dinner because mm -hmm. we are hungry. Very, we skipped lunch. <laughs> <laughs> we did. They had food at the at the place mm -hmm. there, but we didn't, you know, we nah. decided we would save our appetite because we got a special dinner coming up. We are going to... La Bistro. Yes. Which we've heard is like the number one. Uh, it, it's among the top say. that people say you're supposed to try. It's French. French. So very French. Very French. <laughs> They've got escargot. They've got, I don't even know what all Tartar, they Tartare. La how do you say the flotant? They have eaten flotant. You'll see. <laughs> anyway, but we're going to go to Le Bistro. Yeah. Um, how was your day in Tortola? Amazing. Mm. I've already decided I really, really like it. It's beautiful and gorgeous hills and colorful Damn. houses. The people here are really awesome. and They're not pushy or anything. Chill. Yeah, it was a very chill vibe and gorgeous. And um, one of the locals was telling me about all the different islands you could oh, go yeah. to year round and all the beaches. and. All of them are beautiful, apparently. Mm -hmm. So, very lo much looking forward to coming back. I know. We have to come back. We have to go to Virgin mm -hmm. Gordo. We have to go. There's lots of stuff oh, we yeah. need to do. But anyway, right <laughs> now we're going to food. So, yes. <laughs> come on, let's come on. go. Man, they're playing the fill in the lyric game show back there again. We saw that the other day.
come back to the cabin and found our freestyle daily on the bed. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Yeah. <laughs> we came back to the cabin. Dee wanted to change, yeah. actually. Um, but yeah, just got done with dinner at Le Bistro. How was your Le Bistro experience? Very good. I had heard it was good, but it yeah. was. The funny thing is, like, nothing was how I envisioned it would be plated, um, but it was still really, really good. It was. That steak was like one of the most delicious steaks I've had mm -hmm. in a long time. So Yummy. anyway, but we had dinner with Ray and Suzette. They're so cute. And they <laughs> treated us to dinner. It actually they said they said we want to take you guys to La Bistro. Right. It won't cost us anything. They like, make, okay. They've got perks and casino yeah. stuff going on, so it actually didn't cost them to take us out. But it was a lovely meal, and they're yes, so sweet. And thank are. you guys again. That was amazing. I know. Thank you for that. <laughs> um, but good conversation, good mm -hmm. company. Now we're gonna go do some stuff. Yeah. So I don't know what mm -mm. we're gonna catch up with the gang, see what we they're make doing. No plans. <laughs> Exactly. Freestyle cruising. This is how you freestyle cruise. That's right. You just do it. No plans, just yeah. stuff happens. Yeah. So come on. <laughs> you, sir, are no Henry. <clears throat> I've got some music kicking up here in the atrium. We are migrating to the district brew house. Oh, I hear they've got music pumped up in here. Kenny Rogers. Sailing away from Tortola in the dark. Goodbye, Tortola Pier. Oh no. And now it's Tuesday, so we're going on a field trip because it's Taco Tuesday. So in the uh, main dining, no, the main buffet area, we are going to have tacos. Get my facts straight. So we're gonna go check out the tacos at the buffet. I think. Like that snacks. Welcome back to Garden Cafe. Washi washi. Oh, they have vegetable burritos. They're short ribs. Grilled veggies. Oh, what are the tacos? Veggie, ranchero beef, and popcorn shrimp taco. Oh, we gotta look at these from above. What in the world? Okay. Yeah, and then they've got like hummus and quinoa salad, baba ganoush. That's a confused buffet. Well, I guess we'll just keep on wandering. So we got, yeah, salad bar. There's some baby back ribs. It looks like they're doing pasta made to order back there. They've got some penne and turkey scallopini, Cajun mahi, western style farm fries. Okay. All kinds of breads, including little pretzel rolls. These look like the things that you get in Oceans that you dip in cheese. Pasta hajul and onion. And for dessert, they've got eclairs, but we're more interested in seeing this hard scoop ice cream station. Oh, wow. Lemon sorbet, rum raisin. That's a lot of flavors. Oh, they have toppings over there too? So it's vanilla, chocolate, rum raisin, butter pecan, strawberry, lemon sorbet, sherbet raspberry, and no sugar added vanilla. And I've got a whole array of self-serve cakes down here. Mm. Oh wow, past the desserts we got pad thai. Oh, look at all this. There's a whole burger bar up here. What is this? Chicken, dr chicken drummies. Gosh, all oh, this looks so good, and we don't need a bite of it. I got some ice cream though. <laughs> pizza, we got cheese, pepperoni, and barbecue boneless rib pizza. Oh, help me. Yeah, you know, we came up here for tacos, but we found a taste of India. What? Oh my goodness. I know, there's a fish curry. All right, so for lunch, I decided to get a barbecue short rib pizza. But we, we skipped lunch today. Oh, that's true, we didn't have lunch. And a sampling of Indian goodness from the Indian goodness station. Wow. So we're eating in reverse. Shh, it's late lunch, it's very late. <laughs> Goodbye, Indian food, you were delicious. <laughs> oh, you're over there, hey. So good Indian food. Pretty good know, pizza. I know, pizza I'm good. enjoying my late night snacks. I mean my lunch, my late lunch. <laughs> I like that the ice cream is like a slow cat. True. Now we have come back out to the waterfront for some more slightly breezy chilling. 
Oh my gosh, we have presents. Oh, I guess it wouldn't fit in the mailbox. Anyway, but that's awesome. Good night. We are going to bed. We've been hanging out and chatting and yapping for 16 and a half hours, and it is bedtime now. The ocean made you tired. It did, trying to fight for our lives <laughs> the in the current. water. No, it was fun though. It was good. And then we came back to the room and found we have socks on the I door, know. which we know they're from our dinner mates and friends and stuff. Um, <laughs> but I guess we're going to bed. Mm -hmm. So we're in St. Thomas tomorrow. Early day tomorrow, but we have a fun excursion planned. Yeah. We'll talk about it then. Y'all, we're going to be reliving some history, hopefully. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. It'll anyway. be good. So we'll see you tomorrow from yeah. St. Thomas. Oh, it's wiggly. I know. It's kind of wobbly. We did, it's literally like 16 inches from St. Thomas. <laughs> I'm not sure why we're wiggling. Portola. All right. Let's go to bed. <laughs> good night, Bye. guys. Bye.